questions. Welcome everyone. My name is Lynn Schusler Williams. I am a speaker, coach, and author out of Louisville, Kentucky. My great pleasure to be your Wednesday night training call host for our success partners call. We start all of our team calls with our signature message and each and every person on this line can say, I am part of a growing team of entrepreneurs with a shared mission to protect and empower 2 million families and small businesses with Legal Shield's network of law firms and world-class identity theft services. What we do matters and we are looking for help. And with that, I have the great pleasure to go out to someone who probably needs no introduction except for to our newest associates. He is a uh, serial entrepreneur, a leader, a coach, an author, an absolute uh, gift to all of us, Mr. Timmer Halligan. Are you there, sir? The call is yours. I am. Thank you so much, Lynn. I uh, truly appreciate your kind words. And, you know, Lynn didn't say a lot about herself, but, you know, I got the opportunity to meet Lynn several years ago, right when she had first started with Legal Shield, and she was actually speaking to a group of our top executives that she's the author of a book, Nine Little Words to Change Your Results. And I highly recommend you guys get that book. It's a short book. It's a powerful book. It's one that you can read consistently, you know, a few times a month if you want to, a few times a week if you wanted to, and uh, really just a tremendous book. And she came on board with us in Legal Shield and has reached the executive director position, been in Performance Club for years, I believe now. And Lynn, I appreciate you so much uh, for your introduction tonight and all that you do for our team. And welcome everybody to our Wednesday night uh, team training call. I don't know if I call it a Zoom anymore. I mean, a, a call anymore, you know, since we're on Zoom. How cool is technology? You know, I was just thinking as we were all checking in how many years ago uh, we would have to get on a phone call. And even back then, it wasn't as easy as it was is today. There was no free conference call dot com 20 years ago, 15 years ago. And how much easier it is to build this business and bring in that high tech and, and, and uh, high touch together. And so I'm excited to be able to talk tonight uh, to the brand new associates. You know, this call has got two parts. The first one's for the brand new associates. It's about getting folks started the right way with Legal Shield. And so uh, we want to make sure we all get started the same way, the consistent way, a way that we can duplicate and be able to do over and over and over again. So we're going to all get started the same way. And Brand new associates, you made a great decision. You've joined an incredible company. I mean, we, we right now are in the most powerful times that I've ever seen. I mean, we are moving forward at such rapid speeds because we have really simplified the method of getting new associates right. We've opened up distribution channels, not only here in the United States, but uh, in all of Canada starting in October of 2019. Uh, we've already been there for four provinces. Now we're fulfilling that whole thing. May, we're heading over to the United Kingdom. I mean, just massive growth. But let me tell you this. You don't need to know anybody right now in the United Kingdom. Don't need to know a whole lot of people in Canada because right here in our backyard, we've got some incredible, incredible things and, and ability to be able to build this business. So let's talk about getting started. First thing you're going to do is go over to our team's uh, website. Go over to the uh, uh, begintheascent.com. And when you go to begintheascent.com, you're going to go to the getting started section. But I want to show you just a couple things before we get started so you can see all the different resources. Listen, when you first start, it's very easy uh, to get inundated with a lot of different stuff. So we've made it really, really easy. It tells you right here we've got 71 days till our summer blast event. That's going to be in French Lake, Indiana. Going to be amazing. This right here is going to be a calendar of all the events that are going on in Legal Shield across the United States, Canada. You click on it, put your state in there, you'll be able to find out everything that's in your local area. Work with your sponsor so you can get plugged into those events. Uh, this right here is going to take you over to our team Facebook page where we post all kinds of different things on a daily basis to help you get better. Uh, we make sure we keep you abreast of all the announcements that are happening. So you just got to go to that one place. This right here will get you into your back office. Right here is going to take you down this YouTube channel. It is going to take you to where you can watch replays of training calls like our call tonight, plus other resources that we're able to get there for you to watch. And then right here is going to take you over to where it says Shield Nation Leaders. Guys, we are all part of the preeminent team in all of Legal Shield. This organization led by John and Darcy Hoffman, $800,000 income earners uh, with Legal Shield. 
uh, are just incredible, incredible people. And they've created a very, very comprehensive training for us that we can take this business from now into the hundreds of thousands and millions of dollars. And so you definitely want to get plugged in, but we're going to keep it simple right at the beginning. And we're going to go right here to the getting started page. And when you go to this getting started page, when you come over here, we're going to teach you how it is that you're going to get leveled up. Now, you're going to go ahead and click on this icon right here. For some reason, it doesn't click right on my MacBook and my Google Chrome, so I'm not going to do it, but you're going to do that. You're going to click on this icon right here, and it's going to open up a series of videos that you're going to start to watch as a brand new associate. And so those videos are going to show you how to launch your business. It's going to show you what needs to get done to, to get fast start qualified. That's that first promotion that we're looking to help you get. And I'm going to tell you how to do that in just a second, because I'm going to walk you down to a document that you're going to want to print right when you get to this site, because it makes it really, really easy. And so you're going to go right here where it says new associate welcome packet. You click on that. It's going to say, welcome to Shield Nation, Legal Shield. You know, we're, we've been doing this for over 20 years. You know, our organization has written over 1. You know, 5 million memberships as an organization. We got, it, we got it down pat. And we're going to bring you right down here to where it says, first step, launch your Legal Shield business. And you can just take it step by step. That's what's so awesome. You go to step one, get started, you check it off. It says enroll as an associate, an ID Shield member, enroll as an associate. Bam, you've got that done. First step completed. Then it says step two, get connected and use your membership. You want to get yourself connected. You want to get on the phone right now. You want to use your membership. You want to make sure you've got your apps downloaded, the Legal Shield uh, uh, membership app, because that's going to give you access to the law firms for yourself, access to the member perks program, which is there to give you discounts on everything. I was out just the other day and, uh, you know, I was like Miss Lynn Schuster Williams, who led the call. She was talking about last week with member perks, how she was going to Target to buy herself a coffee maker. While she was there, she checked member perks and saved even more money. So I was on my way to Advanced Auto. I said, I got to get this antifreeze. I said, let me just see if they've got it there. I opened it up, 25% off at Advanced Auto Parts, saved me $4.65 and and uh, just by having member perks is on there. So go to the app and, and look for anything that you're ever going to buy. Check member perks first. You want to call the law firm. You want to get used to the process of calling them. You want to start working on getting your will prepared and uh, just finalize all the dots. Once you got everything done, click step two. You want to know how to log into your website. For example, for me, it's your login name. Mine is thhalligan.wearelegalshield.com. Now, Lynn Schusler williams as she works very closely in our uh, Ladies of Justice, which is something you absolutely should participate in. Ladies, uh, I absolutely want you to do it. I mean, listen to, you know, to what Lynn has done and all the other folks have done. It's a tremendous, tremendous initiative. And you can just put your login name dot ladies of justice dot com and uh, you're able to then enroll people from there. You want to make your list. It says use the memory jogger to create a list. The memory jogger is below. It's a list of all the different kinds of professions that are out there. You literally sit down with a piece of paper and you can also watch a video. Mr. John Drennan has uh, our leader on this exact uh, team ascent website uh, right there on the getting started page. It says how to make a million dollar list. Well, he knows because he's made millions of dollars and he's got lots of millionaire club members on his team. And, and so he's going to tell you how to do it, but you're going to have this, this, uh, this memory jogger. It's going to go through. Who do you know? Like tonight's, like, like tonight's speaker, he's a millionaire club member, but if, but if I'd have known him and said, who do you know that promotes big rock concerts? I'd have wrote in Scott's name down and I'd have been able to recruit him many, many years ago and I'd have a millionaire club member on my team. So you just go through this memory jogger and then write down, who do you know? And then we're going to invite people to look at information. That's all we're going to do guys. And I got a great video right here on our team ascent page on this getting started section. It says how to master the invitation process. You just reach out to them. If I was reaching out to Jane Lehman, I'd say, hey, Jane, it's Timmer. What's going on? How are you? What do you got going on tomorrow night? I'd love to invite you to listen to what it is we've got going on with this amazing company. That's as simple as it is. You can invite them on a Zoom call like this, a live meeting you can get from the, uh, from the calendar. You can invite them over to your house or maybe your place of business. We just want to gather people together and have a lot of folks uh, in one place that so we can chat with them. And then we want to make sure that you get your expert on the phone. It says right down here, uh, third party. 
get on the phone with your, your upline, part of your support team. If you're brand new and your support team is brand new, have them work with getting with their executive director or their director. We're here to help, guys. All you got to do is check off the steps. You get to a place, if you're not sure, ask the person that brought you in. We're going to make sure we help you get those questions answered and start moving forward. And then we're going to go ahead and help you fast start qualified. You got all the work done. You've used your membership. You've got a list created. You know how to invite people. Now we're going to work on getting you paid and getting you promoted. And the first thing we're going to do is help you fast start qualify. When you go out and market $60 worth of premium, $60. So you know our membership. You probably have it. You know, let's say you have our family membership. You've got the family ID shield. You got the family legal plan. That's $50. So whoever sold that to you got $50 worth of premium. Now you just got to add $10 more. And so maybe you got just a, somebody who wants to get just the legal plan, or maybe you got a whole nother family. Once you get 60, you automatically fast start qualify when one of them becomes an associate with us. Think about that. $60 worth of premium. That, that, that's such a small amount for what the big value that we bring to folks. One person sees the value comes on board with us. You do that in the first 20 days and you get a hundred dollar bonus. And then, the company says, listen, we're going to pay you to go to training. We're going to, when have you ever gotten paid by your company to go to training? We're going to pay you $100 after you fast start qualified. That's when I recommend you do it. You do follow the simple process, go there. They're going to give you another $100 bonus on top of that. You're going to get to learn from the very, very best how to really learn this, know this business. And then when you come out of there, we're going to help you get to that next position, which is the manager position. We're going to get all of this done in your first 45 days. It's so simple, guys. And then you're going to pick up another $200 bonus. It's, it's truly, truly a remarkable time right now for us in Legal Shield. So, guys, that's really as simple as it is in our business. You're going to see right here a place where you can, as I was saying, here's the memory jogger. Here's a place where you can you know, write your list out. And, uh, you know, then you've got some other documents here that we're going to plug them in. Once they leave your list, they go into this form right here. So we can start to attract to, excuse me, start to track your exposures guys. And, you know, that's really as simple as it is, uh, with our business, with our company and, uh, just get over to our team website. Anything that you need is right there. Again, there's some powerful videos right here. Uh, you know, how to create that list by Mr. John Drennan mastering the invitation process, how to get them on the phone with your sponsor. And guys, that is, uh, that's the simplicity of our business. And so I've got the opportunity now uh, for the second half of our call to go out to a gentleman I met a few years ago. And uh, I was doing a Super Saturday, I believe it was, in the St. Louis marketplace. And uh, he and one of his business partners, they arranged to pick me up in this big limousine. So they had this big limousine. They picked me up and had a little <laughs> shield on the side of it. I was like, holy cow, man, these guys are rock stars. And then I find out that this guy was a rock star promoter. That's what he did. I mean, I'm not talking about, you know, the, the little bitty bands, bands that went on and saw some world, uh, you know, world-class uh, uh, stardom. I mean, they're really, really amazing. And then, you know, he's a millionaire club member in Legal Shield. He's a six-figure income earner in Legal Shield. He'll share his story more, but I'm going to take it and turn it over to my good friend, Mr. Scott Scanlon, are you there, buddy? Yeah, hey, Timmer, man. Thank you so much. Uh, super, super excited to be on the call. Can you hear me okay? Absolutely, man. The call's all yours, buddy. All right, guys. Well, we're going to jump right into it, man. I, I'm, I'm, I'm pumped. Um, you know, like Timmer said, I mean, there's there's never been a better time than right now uh, to be involved in Legal Shield, and, and, uh, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about my journey and my story uh, I'm going to jump over. Let me get my slides pulled up real briefly, guys. Just take a second um, to go to my screen and, uh, and get my slides so you guys can kind of follow along uh, with my journey as I talk to you a little bit about, you know, kind of how I got involved in Legal Shield and, and, and what's happened for me uh, over the last 20 years I've been with the company. Um, and, you know, one of the amazing things uh, tonight, just listening in on the start of this call, just things that are, you know, popping up in my mind is uh, – John Hoffman, wow, I, I can remember the very first uh, training that I went to where John Hoffman, because I came over when the TPN group came over 20 years ago, and John had gotten this cassette tape from Larry Smith called Approach Presentation Close, 
and he did a full training on it and it was amazing because I'll never forget that training I walked out of that training I had the tape I had the information uh, John trained us and I just listened to the tape over and over and over again and I practiced and I rehearsed you know rehearsal is very important so I rehearsed and, and rehearsed and rehearsed and then started doing the presentations and meeting with people and just as true as was promised that my close rate doubled and tripled and my income just took off right from there that was a big turning point man for me uh in the world of legal shield so so i'm excited to talk to you and I, tonight a little bit about my background and a little bit about my journey and then i'm going to do some practical training for everybody tonight um dealing with you know getting started and then also sponsoring because i really believe there are two great fears in the business one is getting started you know where do i start how do i start how do i get a victory how do i get a win and then i got a sponsor or somebody again just another experience and so we'll talk a little bit about that tonight but um, you know we just came back from convention and you know the big theme of the convention I, hopefully you guys pick this up you know I, I mean you had to everybody was talking about it but what does legal shield mean to me um, and I really took that to heart because I've been with the company for 20 years um, a lot of people don't know that the, at the convention uh, the convention hall we were in was the convention hall that mr. stone cypher came out on stage when the TPN merger came over. So a lot of my good friends and, and, and brothers and sisters in Legal Shield that, uh, that I was looking forward to working with because that was a company that was full of people that were all about personal development. That was what they did. I wanted to work with those people. I also wanted to work with a great product that nobody owns, everyone needs, and everyone's gonna buy that I can go out and take it to market and make money and pay my bills and develop a business while I'm developing residual income over time and I found both of those things in legal shield now I come from home of beginnings uh, you know is as, as, as um, Timmer was was alluding to I yes I, I was a rock concert producer that is what I did I, I promoted my brother's band puddle of mud and uh, you know it was amazing it was a, a complete journey you know we, we didn't know uh, anything about the music industry. We didn't know anything about radio. We didn't know anything. Uh, we, they, they knew music. I mean, man, they could, they could play some music. You know, we were, we were influenced. Uh, I wasn't in the band. I'm not a singer. I don't play guitar. My brother, Wes, got his first guitar when he was 13 years old. Uh, it was horrible being in the same room next to him because he made a lot of crazy noise. But one day he started getting good and then he got great and then he got amazing. And then I came back from Australia and he got in a band and it just blew up. And we, we went to work. I mean, we went to work like crazy. We were, we were calling radio stations. We were meeting with everybody that we could. We were getting them on stages, getting in bars, getting in everything we possibly could. And it's amazing what I learned in that process of being a promoter, you know, that I brought over with me into Legal Shield, right? Into the direct sales network marketing experience. I brought all of those skills. Some of them I had to leave behind, but I brought a lot of them with me. And it's been very beneficial to me in my business as I've grown my business over the last 20 years. But here's what happened, okay? Like we ran at that really hard, right? And this is important. And this is what I'm trying to get to here. And he made it, okay? He literally got signed to a major record label. Uh, he got signed by Flawless Records by Fred Durst, which is a division um, of Geffen Records. And, and my brother Wes in Puddle of Mud has sold over 7 million albums. Okay, they got a string of hits on the radio, Blurry, She Hates Me, Drift and Die, Control Psycho. Um, it, it's amazing. I'll, I'll be, you know, driving down the road and Tim will shoot me a picture of one of the songs because he's a big fan of Puddle of Mud. And, uh, and, and I was super super excited for my brother Wes when he got signed to that record deal. But here's the deal. Here's the deal. That wasn't my calling. That wasn't my dream. That wasn't the direction I wanted to go in life. And when he got signed to that record deal, I walked away from all of it because I met a girl, right? I met a girl and, and I, you know, it, she was amazing. My life was changing. Um, I had, uh, I had to overcome some personal uh, some personal challenges, uh, you know, as I'm coming out of the rock and roll, you know, business, and I'm not going to get into all that tonight, but, uh, but Kim came into my life and really just changed my life. We got married February 26, 1999, and we've been working together um, ever since and, and just have a phenomenal, phenomenal marriage. So here's me in my humble beginnings uh, in Legal Shield, 1998, 1999. That's when I got in. That's right when the merger for TPN took place, and I'm living in my grandmother's basement. 
I'm broke. I've, I've lost my, my business. I had two business partners. I was in the cellular phone industry. I lost that business. My brother Wes got signed to a record label and jumped in a jet and flew off to Los Angeles. And, uh, and there I was uh, building my legal shield business and, uh, you know, courting my future wife, Kim. And my first year, and this is, I just want to give this to you because you're seeing me there in my grandmother's basement. That's my clothes all the way around. That was my closet. That's my little bed right there. That's all I had. I had nothing, but I had a dream, okay? I had a dream that I wanted to do something big. And my first year only made $18,000 in Legal Shield, but man, I was on fire for the company, right? And back then the company was only in 44 states. It was, I mean, it was, there was only 200,000 customers. You know, there was no internet. We didn't have an app, okay? We had none of that. We had a brochure. Thank God for John Hoffman coming into Kansas City and teaching me approach presentation close because that's really when everything took off for me. But, uh, but my second year, you know, I made 36000 My third year, I made 49000 in some change. My fifth year in Legal Shield, I made $93,000. And then I hit, you know, really a wall. And it was called the recession. It kind of came in 2006, right? I saw some slowdown in you know, part, partly me because I didn't have some of the leadership skills that I needed, but partly some of the things that were coming that I couldn't control outside of my, outside of my experience. And so, you know, I just had to knuckle down and, and kind of grind it out guys, because this thing isn't all sunshine and rainbows, but here's what happened. Uh, I hung in there. Okay. I hung in there and I stuck it out. Um, you know, I didn't have the hundred thousand dollar ring until uh, 2017. Um, you know, I'd earned $93,000 my fifth year in the business, and it wasn't until 2017 that I got my $100,000 ring. And I hit Millionaire Club member at the exact same time, um, which was great, right? Man, I was so fired up. As a matter of fact, this is what the best part about it was, and this is why it was all worth it. Every part of it was worth it because today I'm earning five figures a month in residual income. Right. And that's getting paid over and over and over again for something that you did one time. I have that in Legal Shield. I have that in my business today. And I've got an amazing life. And because of that, I've been going on, going on, going on to do some some new things that I'm working on today um, with professional speaking and some other things that I'm doing. I've authored a book and some other things I've got going on. So we'll talk a little bit about that. But one, what really got me reflecting on all of this was while we were at the convention, this recent convention that we just came back from a better world with Legal Shield, there was a gal by the name of Pamela Smith and she'd won one of the awards um, and just an amazing thing that they said because she had they asked her you know what does legal shield mean to do mean to you and uh, and she says you know what? i'm doing this because my daughter needs to see me win big again and i got i man i heard her say those words and i mean it just it was like a tearjerker for me because you know there's a lot of ups and downs along the way in this business guys but you got to understand what you're doing and why you're in it and you got to stay the course. Why? Because people are watching you and they need to see me win. My wife needed to see me win big again. I needed family members and, and team members that were around me in Legal Shield to see me winning. You know, and we went through some rough times, but it didn't matter. When we kept our heads up, we worked hard, we knuckled down, we did the steps, we made good income along the way. It wasn't where I wanted to be, but guess what? We never quit, and it turned out over the last 20 years we've been with this company, we've earned well over a million dollars. We're earning a very strong six-figure residual income today, and then we're earning five figures a month in, in residual income, guys. I mean, whether I get out of bed or not, whether I decide to work this year or I don't, I'm still making five five figures, and that's going to continue to grow. Of course, we've also built a team, and that's important as well. And you have to get serious about building an organization and building a team because that sets up the freedom, right? That's the thing that sustains you when you can't stay in the game. I've quit this business literally twice. The first time, I quit for 18 months. The very first year, 12 months, Legal Shield paid me $60,000 in override income, and I wasn't even working. That wasn't residuals. That was just override income because I built a team. Second time I quit, same thing. Close to $60,000 in overrides, no, not residuals, overrides, and today earning incredible income in residuals income. So don't give up. Don't quit. Stay the course. Stick it out. And there's never been a greater time than right now to do this business. So what does Legal Shield mean to me? Legal Shield is a place where I matter. 
Legal Shield is a place where I belong, and Legal Shield is a place where I make a difference. That's why I love this company. I want to go out there and help people identify their talents and help them find a place in Legal Shield where they matter, where they belong, and where they can make a difference. And that's what we do every single day when we go out to the field and talk to people about Legal Shield. So, um, if you want to learn a little bit more about, you know, kind of what I'm doing um, with speaking and things like that, you can go check out my YouTube channel. I'll come back around to that here in a few minutes. But I am authoring a book. I've got my book's written. I'm, I'm working on some final touches and stuff. And so I'm going to try to do something to release that book somewhere around September. But, uh, but there's just a lot of great things that can happen and how you can grow in the world of Legal Shield. So now we're going to switch gears and we're going to talk about practic something practical tonight to help you to build your business, right? I want to talk about new associates. Um, man, you know, there, there's two things that happen. I mean, there's your experience when you come into Legal Shield and your brand new associate. And there's the experience that when you're sponsoring somebody into Legal Shield and, and you're sponsoring for the first time. And, you know, it, it's not something that you're accustomed to. Uh, what you're going to find out is there's going to be a lot of things inside of you that are going to kind of well up. I call them your preferences. Okay. And let me tell you something about your preferences. Your preferences have gotten you to where you are today. Okay. Uh, you have to learn to deny your preferences. When you're getting started as a brand new associate or when you're helping somebody start as a brand new associate, it's very important for them to not let their preferences get, get in the way of them doing the things that might be a little uncomfortable at first, okay, but is going to lead to success because there's preferences and then there's patterns, okay? And what you want to do is deny preferences and, and engage in patterns of success, okay? And patterns of success is very simple. I mean, everything we do in Legal Shield is pretty much cause and effect, okay? There's things that we have to do in the beginning when we're getting started, whether we're sponsoring someone or whether we're, whether we're newly sponsored. We've got, we've got to get started. We've got to make a list, okay? Let me list off one thing that you're going to have to do. You are, if you're going to be successful in Legal Shield, you are going to have to talk to friends, families, you know, for associates in your community, church members, you're going to have to talk to people you went to school with, people that you work with. You're going to have to talk to people around you. You have to learn to become a people person and network, and you've got to represent your product or business. You've got to go out there to the market. So friends, family, neighbors, coworkers, all of those things. That is something that you have to do to be successful in Legal Shield. Let me give you another thing you have to do to be successful in Legal Shield. You have to host a private business reception or a private Zoom call. And I wouldn't say one, I'd say multiple. I'd say two, three, maybe four. I mean, you really gotta get out of the gate and you gotta do that, okay? Here's another thing you gotta do. You've gotta call and invite, okay? You gotta, you gotta literally pick up the phone, you gotta make calls and invite. You can't do all of this on social media. Social media is nice, but it's just like Jeff Olson, or not Jeff Olson, apologize there. Jeff Bell said at the convention, there's a big difference between observation and participation, right? And so you, participation is making calls and inviting and texting people and getting on the phone with them and inviting them to PDRs, inviting them to, you know, a conference call, inviting them to take a look at the information. You have to do that. That's a pattern of success. And then doing three-way calls. And now here's why I'm saying all of this, right? Because all of these things are, are the first time you consider them, it's a bit of a fear factor, right? I mean, it kind of it's kind of scary. It's like, okay, I got to make a list. I got to call friends, family, relatives, coworkers, and neighbors. I got to host a private business reception. I got to pick up the phone and call people and, and make the phone calls and invite. I got to put a I got to put a, a, a somebody I know on the phone with a complete stranger, right? You know, do a three way call. I mean, all those things kind of freak us out a little bit. Or you're sponsoring for the first time, and you've got to assist in that process. But here's the thing. If you can, you know, deny your preferences and engage the pattern, okay, things will start working. Let me give you an example of what I mean. You guys probably know who these two guys are here. That's the Prince of Darkness on the left, and that's Tom Bray uh, over his shoulder. But they have a saying, okay, at the Patriots that said, they say, athletes get tired, systems never do. And see, that's the brilliance. Like, you can't, if you try to do everything on your own, it, first off, it's not going to work, number one. Number two, it's not ever going to leave you. You want your business to leave you. You want it to move away from you a thousand miles away, a dud talking to a stud. It works. Somebody buys a membership, becomes an associate, it duplicates and multiplies all over the country, and you get paid. So athletes get tired. Systems never do. Associates that are, you know, one-hit wonders get tired. Systems never get tired. you got to focus on the system. So you want to launch with the system. Now, I love 
what Darnell said at convention. Okay. He said, there comes a time when you have to leave the facts behind and step into your fear by faith. Now, what did he mean by that? You know, a lot of times we get into a business and we feel like we got to go get all the information before we can get started. Now, I got to go to fast start training before I can get started. I got to listen to this conference call before I can get started. I got to set up my uh, prospect by legal shield and get my business business cards and before I can get started. No, 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 no. There just comes a time when you've got to leave those things behind and step in by into your fear by faith. Now, what do I mean by that, right? Okay, there's, somebody's going to help you get started. They're going to work with you, right? You, what you have to do is deny your preference to do it the way you want to do it and listen to their training and do it the way they're training you to do it. And if you can't beat the fear, and I'm going to try to help you beat fear tonight, but if you can't beat the fear, you got to do it scared. You just got to do it, okay? You just got to get started. So you got to do it even when you're scared, right? And I'm not just talking to the brand new associate. I'm talking to the sponsoring associate. You got to help that person make those calls. You got to sit down with them and help them make their list. Now, that's really the disconnect I see in the market right now is a lot of people want to just kind of plug people into the little quick little system and then everybody gets lost in social media and nobody ever gets around to sitting down with each other and making the list and actually working together to make the calls and do the invites and the whole process. That's what we used to have to do in the very beginning. That's why Legal Shield exploded because we had a system. As a matter of fact, John Brennan probably remembers it. It was called the power system. And it came in a booklet. I remember the first time I did it when I sat down and helped a brand new person get started. It was the worst training ever. I was with them for two hours. The guy ran, never saw him ever again. But I did the next one, and then I did the next one. And I got a little bit quicker and a little bit better at the power system, really, which was the getting started right training, the beginning of getting started right training for Legal Shield, right? And today, we still have the same system. We just got to be, if we got to spend time with people and in invest in them and help them get started, right? So we have to overcome that fear also as well. So if you can't beat the fear, you got to do it scared. Now, this is what I call um, accelerated self-development, okay? There's this phenomenal guy, his name's Adam Phillips. He's the founder of Life Grip. Um, I'm going to, on my next slide, I'm going to give you some information so you can listen to this audio because it's a very inspirational speech that he gave. But what he focuses on is, you know, kind of identifying, you know, and I can see where this works for a lot of people. I know it's worked for me. It, it's kind of like when you're doing the debt snowball um, with, um, oh gosh, I'll think of his name here in a minute, the guy that, that handles finances. But, uh, but in the debt snowball, you start with something small, and then once you conquer it, you do the next thing and the next biggest thing and the next biggest thing, and you get a little bit more strength as you go. And the next thing you know, it turns into a snowball that turns into an avalanche and just wipes out all of your debt, right? Okay, so we understand what that means, but the same thing can be done with, you know, overcoming fear, right? And so what he does is he has just a system that you put together where he identifies maybe his, you know, top, you know, three fears, okay? Um, you know, maybe his top five fears, top 10 fears, right? But he wants to start with this third greatest fear, right? You don't start with the first one. You don't start with the most scariest. You don't start with the second most scariest. You start with the least scariest. Now, in our business, in, in Legal Shield, in getting started, what would be the least scariest thing to do in, in a getting started process? Meeting with your sponsor and doing the game plan interview, right? Getting, sitting down, identifying your, 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 your targets, making your list, creating your list, coming up with a game plan, scheduling your private business reception, scheduling your Zoom call. That's probably the least scariest thing that you're going to do, but it, it's the one thing that's going to build some confidence, right? And what happens is if you can start with the least scariest thing, when you conquer the least scariest thing first, when you knock that thing down, okay, here's what's going to happen, okay? By default, your confidence is going to grow. By default, you're going to get stronger. And then what are you looking at next? The second most scariest thing. What's the second most scariest thing? Getting started, making those calls, and inviting people to your private business reception, right? That's the second most scariest thing. Now, here's the deal. If you do the least most scariest thing first and you knock that down and you're a little bit more confident, you're a little stronger, 
aren't you going to knock the second one down maybe just a little bit faster? It's so important, though, that we do it together, right? Sponsors, you need to assist your people in making the calls and doing the invitations. You need to schedule time to do that together. When you do that together and you do it in tandem, here's what happens. You step into your fear and you get on the other side of fear. Once you get on the other side of fear, you own the space and you can grow into it. See, you gotta help people overcome the fear and have a few victories. When you're making phone calls together and when you're contacting and inviting together, it's quite, a, number one, it's fun. Number two, the other person realizes, oh, this isn't as scary as I thought it was gonna be. And then all of a sudden they get confident and they get some momentum going. And the next thing you know, you know, we're looking at fear number one. And what's fear number one? having your private business reception, having your private Zoom call, right? And you got to do it together, right? But that's okay. Like you're building up your strength. By default, you're stronger. By default, you have more confidence. By default, you're ready for the next level. The next thing you know, you're, you're owning the number one fear. And next thing you know, you're owning the space. Next thing you know, you're owning the system. And when you own the system, when you understand the system, when you've mastered the system, the sky is the limit for you and your business. And that's what Adam Phillips trains. You know, one of the things I would encourage you to do is when you do, if you do visit my, my YouTube channel or if you just want to look it up, but I've got it posted there under inspirational speeches. And you just go look up Scott Scantlin. I'm on YouTube. You can follow me. I got, I, 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 I put up fresh videos every Tuesday. Okay. So I drop fresh videos with training and stuff like that every Tuesday, but on my YouTube channel, you'll see the step into your fears or face your fears. Adam Phillips. You can just search it if you want to pull it up and listen to that It's 16 minutes and 32 seconds long. And for those of you that are trying to overcome the fear, that audio, if you listen to that every morning, every, I listen to it every single day, but if you listen to it every morning um, and win the morning with it, man, it will help you. It'll give you so much confidence and so much courage. You will go out there and you will just break through walls and do amazing things. So I want to encourage you to do that. See, here's the deal. You're enough. Okay, you are enough. You already have everything that you need inside of you. You have it all already. Okay, but you, there will never be anybody better. You'll never be anybody better than yourself, right? And and that's the thing. You got to forget about you know the cool kids. You got to you got to forget about all that. When people know you, people like you, they're going to hang out with you. And when you're taking a run at your dreams. Okay, when you're, when you're going out and you're going after your dreams, there's going to be people in your inner circle, people that you've known all of your life. They're going to be friends and they're going to be relatives and stuff like that. And they're going to push back, right? I mean, they're going to, they're, they're going to, they're going to not, you know, not be excited about what you're doing, right? And it isn't because they're, they're trying to, you know, tear you down. You know, I mean, honestly, they love you. We know that, right? They're loved ones and family members and sometimes, but here's the problem, right? They, they don't want to get left behind. Okay, they don't want to be left alone. What, what they don't want to do is get left on their level. You're going to experience that. That is a part of being in this business. Adversity is normal. I cannot tell you how many friends and family members that pushed back on me that know what I do today, know how busy I am, completely respect me, send me business, send me referrals. But when I first got started, I was doing that legal shield thing, right? And matter of fact, I've even had a couple of them say to me, it's always cute when they say it, you're still doing that thing? I'm, oh yeah, I, yeah, I am. Yeah. Wow. How's that? You've done really well with that. Haven't you? I'm like, oh yes, it's been, it's been an absolute blessing and we just are very excited about our business and wow that's really great Scott I'm really proud of you right and, and this is what people that push back say later I'm really proud of you I really admire you for sticking to something good and walking it out sometimes you got to walk it alone sometimes you got to kind of go a different direction and when you're chasing after your dreams not everybody's gonna want to come along with you they're going to want to stay on their level. They don't want to be left behind. They don't want to be left alone. They're going to want to stay on their level. And that's okay. you got to be, you got to have the courage to step away from that. Just because they don't have the courage, okay, to step into their fears and see what's on the other side, okay? Because don't let that stop you because the worst thing that can happen is this, that you get to later years in life, okay, and you look back. And, you, you, and you're disappointed that you didn't go for it because you were worried about what somebody else thought, okay? What does it matter what they think, 
that that doesn't matter. You got to go for it. It's up to you and you got to take and you got to step into your fear. You got to have the courage to step into your fear. And whether that's the courage to get started and using accelerated personal development, like I talked to you tonight, accelerated self growth, like I talked to you about tonight, make sure you listen to Adam Phillips and listen to that, that audio overcoming fear. Okay. You got to have the courage to step into your fears. Whether you're sponsoring somebody for the first time, you got to courage. You got to have courage, and you got to step into that, and you got to embrace that, and work together, and grow together, and become one, and become a team. You guys got an amazing team. I'm just blown away by this entire conference call tonight. Everything I've seen, and of course, you know, I model Timmer. I follow Timmer Halligan. He's the one guy right now that I if people ask me all the time, who's who? Who are you watching in legal shit? I said, I'm watching. I'm watching Timmer Halligan. Why? Because he's on it. Okay. He's got the enthusiasm. He's got the courage. Okay. He's got the strength. He, he is, he's getting attention. He's all over social media. You guys got an awesome leader to follow there. You got amazing, awesome leaders in your organization, but I am extremely impressed right now. I just think he's a man of the, of the, of the time and of the season and you guys got great leadership. So I want to encourage you to just follow Timmer, follow your team, follow your leadership, work together. And, uh, and if, if, if you like get over to my YouTube channel, subscribe, you can follow me also as well. We put tidbits out and things like that. Um, but uh, I'm excited to be a part of Legal Shield, man. This is a place where I matter, where I belong, where I make a difference. And you need to go out there and recruit people and help people find their place with their talents, where they matter, where they belong, and when they make a difference. And when you do that, everything you ever want, you'll have. And so with that said, Mr. Halligan, uh, excited to be on the call tonight. Thanks for allowing me to share, and I'll send it over back to you. Well, uh, thank you so much, Scott. Truly appreciate you and, you know, your transparency and, and, you know, definitely guys get over and subscribe to his channel, you know, such a great guy. And, you know, that's what's so awesome about our company is that there's so many tremendous, tremendous leaders that are always willing to pour in. And, you know, I had a lady today ask me, she said, Hey, if I attend an event in another town and I don't have anybody from our team there, are we going to be okay? And I said, absolutely, because that's what this company is all about. So I appreciate you guys joining us. I'll get this uploaded to our YouTube channel, uh, ASAP. You guys have a fantastic evening and uh, bye-bye for now. Bye.